Welcome to Eat With More Love. So you guys, tonight I got some Chinese chicken. Yes. See that? Does that look yummy? Yummy? Yucky. Let me turn it around for you. See that? And I wanted some celery for some reason. So I got celery and ranch dressing. See that there? Can you see that? A little closer. Okay. And some water. I got my water bottle, coldest water bottle in the house. Okay. So first I'm gonna say my grace. Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for this food we're about to receive. Nourish our bodies, so Lord. Take anything that's in our view out of this food. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 So I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day today. I just wanted some chicken. And plus, it's Chinese chicken salad. I mean, chicken. <laughs> Chinese chicken. Fried chicken. And... I love chicken any kind of way. So, I'm going to go ahead and dig into this. Let y'all know how this is. Because this is my first time tasting it. I made it myself. Me. Yes. So, let's dig in. Mmm. 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 Okay. I'm going to say this. Because I know that was my first bite, but this chicken have a taste that's just so much mm, out of this world. It's a little different, you know. You have the regular fried chicken that you're used to. This just has a little sweetness and tang to it. Just makes it really good. Mmm. I'm just gonna put it down. Put it down. <laughs> Not gonna put it down. So anyway, I hope everyone has had a wonderful day today. Today was a pretty busy day for me today. I went out shopping, grocery shopping. Mm -hmm. Sometimes grocery shopping can be a task, especially when it's a bunch of people out there doing the same thing. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Yep, you took my tummy. No. When you're out there shopping. It seems like soon as you get ready to go, everybody want to go grocery shop. It was really busy. But it was pleasant. I don't let people get to me, but it was a lot of people in the grocery store doing the same thing. Mm-hmm. Mm, mm, mm. This chicken is so good. And normally, I clean the bomb. <laughs> mm. I clean it up. My kids be like, dang, mom. I got to 
grown and everything on my mouth. Gristle. <laughs> I know. But some people like it, some people don't. I like it. I love me some gristle. On the chicken. I don't like all the gristle, but chicken gristle. Mm -hmm. And I love celery with ranch. This is one of my husband's least things is celery. A little ranch of celery and chicken meal. That's for me. Mm. I was gonna bring some sauce out or some hot sauce. You know how we do it, but I just wanted to have chicken this time. Nothing but chicken. You know, usually when I have some hot some chicken, I put on hot sauce or some beloved sauce. Oh my goodness, that's good with chicken. If you never tried it, get you some beloved sauce. Dip your chicken in there. Ooh, let me tell you that's good. But today I said I'm going to just keep it like this. Because I wanted to try the, the Chinese chicken just to see how it tastes with the ingredients that go in it. It has, oh my goodness, it really does have a little different taste. And it's got a little sweet soy sauce kind of not too much but it's really good mm-hmm and I like everything piping hot mm-hmm you'd like that mm. so good Mm -hmm. I like to get all the chicken off the bottom. Mm. So anyway. I just want to know what you guys is doing this year I know it's today's the first I think anyway what is your New Year's resolution some people wait till the end of January to start it or the beginning of February but just let me know in the comments tell me I don't like making New Year's resolutions. <laughs> Just keep it real. I'm leaving it real. Because I may not keep it. I just do things as I say I am. And if I don't, I ain't said no promises and no New Year's resolutions. So... Because usually things I really want to do, I stick to it. It seems like as soon as you say, oh, my New Year's resolution is, 
you end up not doing it. That's why I don't make them anymore. I just pray to God that I wake up the next morning. That's my resolution. <laughs> to give honor to God every morning. That part. Yeah, so. Anyway. One thing this year that I'm kind of sad about is my daughter graduated, my baby. She's my youngest. And okay, so she's 17. And she just started being where she, I want to go here. I want to do this. I want to do that. Before that, this girl stuck to me like Lou. I know I always talk about my family, but it's my heart. Um, She stuck to me like Lou. Everybody used to say, where's Abria? Where is she? They didn't have to say that before. Now they ask me because she's. She's moving on, doing her thing, and I'm like, I ain't used to this. <laughs> Even though she used to get on my nerve, I it's hard to get used to. You know, your baby moving away and not being around. I mean, every step I took, she was right there. I'm in the kitchen, she in the kitchen. Even in the bathroom, here she is. I'm like, what? And now, she graduates this year. She's 17, and she'll be 18 in August. Man, it's like, really? What are you doing? <laughs> I'm calling her on the phone. Where are you at? I'm at school. Oh. Yeah. It's hard. It's kind of hard to let go of your babies. But I understand I have to let go. My other babies, they are my babies. They'll be my babies forever. Forever, ever. My oldest is 32. And still my baby. And then my other one is 28. And then her. So, you can kind of see. Mm. This the um, gap between them. But, um. Me and her, I believe, was the closest of all my kids because of that gap, probably. And I mean, she was really close with her mom. I would call her my tenderloin. And um, now that she's going to be going away, Well, she's going to be graduating. Then she's going to go to the military. I try and do. Everything I can to keep her around. I be calling, you out of school yet? Oh, uh, just right now? Oh, okay. Well, can you come and do this? And I know I've been getting on her nerve. But I had to just explain to her, girl, you're my baby. I don't have no more kids to be next to me, be in the house. It's going to be an empty nest. 
I ain't gonna know what to do with myself. Nobody to fuss at. <laughs> Shoot. Uh, me and my husband. Oh, my granddaughter's around a lot, though. I always tell my daughter, this is my baby now. Believe it or not, she get jealous. Like she's not your baby. Yes, she is. She's my grandbaby. I want to go still. I think this is the best thing I ever invested in. One of water bottles. I ain't even care about no greasy mouth, none of that. This chicken is really good. On top of me being hungry. I miss my other sons to California. They in California. But trust me, I'm about to head there. My grandkids, most of them are there in California. See my grandbabies. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Oh, Especially it's my dad. My daddy. And my Mima. I'm gonna go out there for them and Hook up some gumbo. I'll be doing some videos out there too. Um. Yeah. <clears throat> I miss them so much. Happy February 2019. I don't know, y'all. I got a feeling this year is going to go by much faster. Than um, last year. It's just a feeling. Because um, last year went by really fast to me. And my granddaughter might be walking through here. But she pretty good. She ain't moving around. Um. So I'm thinking sometime this month, maybe around my son's birthday, I might have to slip out there and surprise him. That would be sweet. I might just do that. I love celery. Mm. 
sticking out. This celery and I am kidding. This is a pretty good little match right here. So celery and some chicken. Smacks. <laughs> you feel me? I'm serious. It really is good. My granddaughter don't know what I got over here because she'd be over here trying to eat my chicken. Stop that. I ain't gonna eat y'all. Anyway, y'all. I'm about to finish this piece of chicken. Eat all my celery. Drink some more water. Oh, that's so good. Some comments, subscribe, like my video, and don't forget to hit the bell, bell, ding, ding, bell, bell. Okay, that way you can get all my notifications <clears throat> for when I put up a new video. And eat with more love. And love what you eat. All right? See you guys next time on my next video. I might be doing some cooking. Watch out for the next one. I got some things going on, 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 on. So check me out. Holla.